Yo, locked in episode seven. Um, let's get into it. So this is from March tenth to the twenty third. How I always structure these is I'm just gonna go over what I set for myself from the last video, my progress I've made on those tasks, as well as my goals for the next two weeks. Follow me on Instagram. I have a free Discord calls every week. They're free. Join it. Next thing. So. Previous situation. So essentially from February 24th to March 9th, I had had a closer. He left. I closed a few people, which was helpful. I got a lot more consistent in the gym. I had a talk with one of my family members and he helped me to realize that even if I was successful in the college life, the route that gets me to, that still leads me to a place I don't want to be. So I you know, this, this episode I dropped out, um, my mindset got way, way, way better. I realized like how good you can actually do, how quickly and how easy it is. And I think I was limiting myself beforehand. Um, I started reading reality transurfing, which is awesome. And my phone still don't have my phone, but it's on grayscale now to use it less. Um, my best day of the previous period was $6,500. Which is a good day, you know. It's better than days beforehand. Um, progress for the agency in the meantime. We did not necessarily keep going at six thousand dollar days, as you can see, because what happened was our ad account got banned. So we had introduced a bunch of onboarding systems. We trained people to call our leads, but our ads were down. So we didn't have much new people coming in. Facebook had banned us from advertising. I think three times in the past two weeks, but we got back and it was helpful eventually. They were saying that I was doing discriminatory policy because of a funny ad that may or may not have been a tiny bit racist. You know, you could see that if it's on my Instagram. Um, and you can see here behind this photo right here, this photo is an empty calendar, which is not good. Um, can't have that. So we didn't have any leads until like the end of the second week, probably until Thursday of this past week. Not good. On my lifestyle side of things, phone was still grayscale. I got cocky because I realized by this point, this was like more than I'd ever made ever before the ninth. And I was like, okay, something, something's up. And I got kind of, I don't know. I was content. I hadn't realized that any number that I accomplished isn't, shit compared to like what other people are actively doing um a lot of my old habits came back i didn't read any more reality trans surfing which was that book that actually helped me so much and one of the reasons i was working so hard is because i realized that if i did move out if i didn't continue the route i was going with school i thought i was going to be kicked out from my house which you know same setup i wasn't which is helpful but this right here is the house that I was going to stay in, which was very cool. It was a pretty nice spot. But when when ads died, as you can see right here, not much on the calendar, it just kind of fell apart. And I need to stop really doing the inputs that got me to a place that I was somewhat like, I wasn't upset with where I was. Um, lessons. I need to not stop because I always stop um whenever i do well whether it's like right here or you know right here again i don't keep the momentum going forward i can slow down that's fine i can go less hard after i hit a goal you know take work like four or five hours a day or something right but you don't i don't need to stop like that's still nothing and i need to organize my life around something that makes it really easy for me to get this type of thing done and the numbers at a certain point when I was doing really well for this month, especially, I don't feel like I'm working super hard or doing anything crazy. It's just kind of repetition at this point. And because I'm doing the correct inputs, like just the like equal amount of money is just coming back and it feels weird. And I was making the most in this month when I was completely detached from oh, we need to hit this amount. Oh, we need to collect this amount. It's like, okay, I need to do 
this input, this input, this input, and do as much of those as I could every day. And as soon as I stopped doing that and just realized, like, this is more money I've ever had in my account, that's when I started to fall off. Because as soon as you start focusing on, like, the money part of it, it doesn't help as much. At least it didn't for me. And this is just another example of it right here. So this is when I first hit 10K. So you guys can see I was kind of like building momentum. First month, like 300 bucks or something right here. And then like two grand and then three grand and then a little bit less. And then I went to 13K right here. Turned to $13,149. And then next month I was back down to like three grand or something. And the next month was like two grand. And then, you know, we started to go back up. And you'll, you'll see the graph at the end of this month. It was a, you know, it's a pretty solid graph. But I need to stop doing, I need to stop stopping, essentially. I need to always continue to do what's been helpful and beneficial for me. Um, again, the losses. For the first half of the month was, or the two weeks was honestly super helpful. I was going to the gym consistently and I was able to get done everything I needed to. But again, I just stopped doing the, what gets me to where I need to get to. Um, I did not read enough of Reality Transurfing. I know I use this photo in all of them, but it's the only photo of the book I have. And I actually got the audiobook to make it easier for me to listen to it now. And I need to understand the whole book because just that little tiny piece of the book helped me so much. I also did not go to the gym enough. So I'm... I'm trying to train a new closer that allows me enough time to do things like go to the gym at the end of the day and just like kind of unwind and, and things like that. My goals for the next two weeks, very similar as last time, really just push the inputs as hard as possible, more ad spend, more setting, more closing, training team, read reality transurfing, go to the gym, and et cetera, as it says right there. But really just stick to the schedule. Just like find a good media buyer who's going to help me. So if you guys are a media buyer, reach out at Wi-Fi Levi on my Instagram. Uh, we're looking to hire someone. You'll be managing 20 accounts right now. It'll probably be double, triple that soon with what we're doing in ad spend. And we're looking forward to, to working with you. Um, I need to plan my Miami trip. I need to buy tickets. I need to get all that stuff done because I'm going to an event out in... It's not in Miami, but I think I'm flying into the Miami airport, though. I need to get a give my closer enough calls so that he's collecting at like 30%. Honestly, with my offer, he should be closing it higher, but, you know, a win is a win. I'll take it. And I just need to call every single lead. Like double dial him, triple dial him, call them more, and just see where that gets me. It's really not that hard. But for the next two weeks, I think... I'm going to hit another goal that will be worth making like a separate video about. So I might not upload another locked in or maybe just next week after I do really well this week, I'll upload something, but we'll see. Um, as always, shoot me a follow on the gram to get access to the free server. One of my boys, Ahmed, hosts weekly calls every Saturday, as you can see right there. And if you want to hop on a call with me, we have an inner circle as well. That's free if you make over 10K. And if you make under 10K, you can just pay a little bit to be, be in there with us. But other than that, that is it for this week. Made it short, made it quick for you guys. Don't waste your time. If you're watching, I probably wouldn't if I was you. This is not the most valuable content in the world, but it's just a really honest... It's just the personal Levi audit, so I can look back on this and just see what I was messing up on and fix some changes. But yeah, subscribe, follow me, and I will see you.